So I have been using this software for several years. It's called PDF Element and it's by far the best PDF editing software, a great alternative to Adobe Acrobat. And uh, today I will show you the PDF Element 7, the newer version, which you can download from the official website and also from Mac App Store. The link will be in the description and don't forget to grab the 50% discount they are offering right now. So let's get started with the review and uh, it's a very simple easy to use software yet it's very much feature rich with uh, OCR with converters a complete PDF editing solution to maximize your productivity here I have opened a PDF let's start with some basics uh, let me show you how you can uh, edit PDF text uh, it's just like MS Word just click on the text and start typing as you can see the text matches the existing text in size in font and you can resize the text field as you wish move it anywhere what I like most about PDF element 7 is the smoothness and the responsiveness even if the PDF is like 100 pages long Let's move on to the next option, Markup, where you get different tools. Firstly, you get Highlight, so select the color and highlight any text of the PDF. Our next option is Strike Through, so strike through any text just like that. You have Underline Pencil, uh, so you can draw anything on the PDF, which is useful for annotations, corrections. Uh, there is also an eraser for the pencil. New text can be added anywhere on the PDF. There is also this text callout box, very useful for annotations. It can be created just like that. Next we have sticky notes. So add a note just like so on the PDF. So whenever the end user hovers the mouse pointer over the sticky note, they can check the pop-up message. Different types of shapes, arrows are available including some stamps. So put the stamp anywhere, you can resize it, move it and of course you can create a signature and place it anywhere as you wish. Next we have the image editor for of course uh, moving, resizing, uh, deleting or inserting a new image into the PDF. The tools are up here, you can also rotate, crop and extract any image into your computer, you can replace it with your own. Let me actually change this image to my son's uh, beautiful picture. So there it is, it's very very easy to do. The next tool here is link, so you can link any text or any image, anything on the PDF to any web page or any page of the PDF itself. So if I click on the text, it will take me to the page number 8 just like that. Let me now show you how to link to any web page. Uh, so let me input Wikipedia link. The appearance can be changed to denote a hyperlink. So now I can click here and it will directly take me to the Wikipedia web page. The next menu option is for editing forms which I will talk about later. You can redact any keyword from the PDF. You can redact any text manually and also any page of the PDF. Just input the page numbers or the page range and there is also another option. You can search for any keyword on the PDF and it has been mentioned 19 times in the PDF. You can check individual pages, uh, select any page or all the keywords in the PDF and redact. This is how you can redact maybe your personal information like your name, your phone number, address, etc. There are a couple of other additional very important tools here like uh, OCR which I will talk about in a minute. You can edit the background and also add any watermark. It can be any text which you can create right in here. If you have any kind of image or logo you can upload, the logo can appear on top or behind the page and you can also control the opacity. PDF element 7 supports batch processing. 
let me show you how this works i will add multiple pdfs to perform batch processing so first of all you can convert any one or multiple pdfs to word excel powerpoint pages epub html rtf text and even image OCR can be performed, you can add bits, numbering, watermark, background, header and footer. You can also encrypt, combine or remove the PDFs and also extract data. Now it's time for to show you OCR that is optical character recognition. Suppose you have taken a picture of a book or maybe newspaper then converted that into a PDF or image. Now. If you want to copy the text or convert the PDF into editable or searchable text, then OCR helps you. So the PDF I have opened is all good, but the first page is basically an image. You cannot extract or edit the text on the image. So let's perform OCR and see what happens. It's an add-on to the software. So if you want this feature, you have to download this extra file. So let's wait. After the installation is complete, let's perform OCR and see what happens. First select the document language and the page numbers you want to perform OCR. Now you can either transform PDF image text to real text or searchable text keeping the image intact. There you go guys, it's done, now let's check. As you can see guys the text field has been detected and I can insert new text and also edit the font the size of the existing text just like you do on word and also on PDF editor. Now one of my favorite features on PDF element 7 is the PDF form editor here I have downloaded one form from the internet and with this software I can actually make it interactive. Starting with the text field option, you can input text here. The attributes of the text field can be changed and also tooltips can be added, which is quite useful. So the end user will see a pop-up whenever they hover the mouse pointer over the text field. Next, we can add checkboxes, radio buttons, drop-down menu, as well as buttons now the end user can click on the check boxes and also radio buttons select from the drop down menu and also push the button and also digital signature field can be added anywhere on the pdf and if the end user don't have any digital signature they can create one the form alignment and other attributes can be changed and also there is form field recognition that is it will recognize our different kinds of fields and add appropriate input fields which saves a lot of time. Even a signature field has been added just like so. Indeed, Wondershare PDF element is worth a try. It's the all-in-one ultimate solution for PDF editing. And don't forget that they are offering 50% discount. The link is in the description. Here is the pricing details. I hope that this video was useful. Thanks a lot for watching.